So there's a natural interface between the outputs of medic opportunity qualification and my value-based conversation that, that I have with the customer. I like to think about it is that art is what happens when I'm with the customer. Science is what happens when I'm not. So there's right. a lot of science that's required to make the art form happen. Medic is science. My conversation with the customer, my value-based conversation with the customer is art. It's like you see these improv artists or these stand-up comedians, you think they're just winging it. They're not. I mean, for every half hour I'm up there, there is a week of preparation, right? And the quality of conversation I have with the customer is directly proportional to the amount of work I, I put into it. And that's where Medic comes into play. And that's why you don't want to cheat it. And that's why you, you don't want to make it just a compliance drill because it is going to increase the probability that I have a great customer conversation because it zeroes me in on exactly what I need to be doing as part of that call. Then the post-call debrief, also powered by Medic, is a mechanism of taking stock of where I am and where I you know, therefore need to be moving forward. So it's a continuous virtual loop that's so far away from compliance and inspection. It's just the way I need to run my sales organization if I really want to you know, you know, qualify, progress, and close these deals as quickly as possible. And there's obviously a, a positive impact on things like forecasting accuracy, right? And slip deals. And one of the worst things in the world that can happen is I have a deal that falls out late in the sales cycle that was never meant to be. And I've involved my engineers, I've involved my finance and accounting team, my deal desk, and I had everybody working on things that were never meant to be rather than qualifying it out early and working on something that has a higher probability of a, of a result. But you just can't do that winging it. There has to be some science behind all of that that powers the art form of the actual sales call. Right, and that's what you're talking about here, Dave, is that, that intersection of medic and the sales process and then into sales messaging. Your teams need to have the ability to have the conversation that allows them to get the information to qualify the deal, to fill in the gaps. And that's why the sales messaging component is so important